can't tap them. Can I tap them? Uh-huh. This is the area that was damaged on the coral before I started to cut it. I just recut on the tips just to make sure I get an even fresh cut. I do it again here. And I do it again here just to make sure any algae or any protozoas are on there are going to be gone. They won't be attached to the next cutting. And I'm going to take the base of the coral and I'm going to cut around it. Even this base part will grow in branches and form stalks. And I'm just going up here because I wanted to make sure that the part that was damaged is actually going to go off of the original mother colony and go out into the grow out. This animal came to us not with, without a base. So what we're going to do here now is glue this mother colony to one of our garf plugs so that It'll stay in place when I place her in the food stock tank. Dab her glue. Rub the animal around on the plug. Waiting for the glue to kind of stiffen a little bit. Hold it in place. Put it in water. Hold it in place. The, the water is going to actually set the glue so it'll firm up and hold it. And I just like to hold it hard for a couple of seconds. 